and part two. As we come up the stairs, we have a little landing area and our bathroom that services the three remaining bedrooms that are up here. Combination tub and shower and dual vanity. In the back, the bedrooms themselves are a very good size. This one is an extremely large walk-in closet but a ceiling fan in the closet as well. <laughs> All right. And this one, again, is a very good size. A nice tall window as well comes in. And a decent sized closet on this one as well. Our third bedroom that's upstairs. Nice ceiling fans, double closet. And finally, the master bedroom itself. The large tray ceiling. Good amount of space. And bay window overlooking the backyard that could be a perfect office or master's retreat. See, it looks back on the backyard with a nice big crepe myrtle that's just right in front. And you'll see where those are going to get some nice little flowers on it. And finally, we have the master bath. Master bath has two, uh, two bays, his and hers. His having the shaver height, just a little bit taller than what you typically see. We have a ceiling fan in the bathroom, which again is something that you don't get to too often. And here we have a great big garden tub with a jacuzzi feature. The master closet itself is a very good size. Extends back on either end. Our water closet here. And here we have what would be the linen closet. And you could just as easily put a coat rack going across that end too for just a little bit extra space. First here we have access to our attic, which has our HVAC system, our furnace and blower here. And of course, our hot water tank on the far end, and just a little bit of additional storage. We can see where they have a little bit of extra carpet. Yeah. And so concludes the tour.